we're going to put the pin just to the midline of the thorax and the important thing is that you put the pin on straight so that the uh, body is perpendicular to the pin also that the body is not tilted to the right or the left when you look at it we then will take the pinning block and put the insect at the correct height on the pin using the, the tallest level so now we have a hand a little handle up here all the insects will be at the same height we then will take this insect and use this styrofoam block and press to be able to help position our legs in position so that it's easier to identify them. We're going to push these insects right down flush to the surface of the styrofoam. And so you can see it's right down flush on the surface of the styrofoam. You can then use a pointed probe to start to position the antennae and the legs so that it would be easier to see the various tarsal segments on the ends of each leg. If you leave them all tucked underneath, as occurs on most dead insects, it's going to be very difficult to see. And it's much nicer to look at an insect that has the legs nicely spread and looks kind of natural 